Uh, first of all, thank you guys for having me. Uh, we got six minutes to get this thing done, so strap on your seatbelts. All right, uh, a little bit about me. I uh, born and raised here in Ocala. Uh, after high school, went down to USF and uh, earned a master's degree in exercise science uh, with a concentration on strength and conditioning and a, a, a minor in public health. All right, likewise, have an internationally recognized certification in strength and conditioning, which is uh, technically still like the gold standard from a performance standpoint, uh, but also have work experience, you know, working in a variety of settings from, from kids from, you know, six to adults as old as 66, okay? So uh, very diverse in that standpoint. Uh, one notable thing, I uh, was also a strength and conditioning intern for current World Series uh, Houston Astros a couple years ago while I was in college. Uh, picture of the gym. Uh, our mission is helping busy professionals restore their health and athleticism, okay, while protecting them against chronic illnesses and those acute injuries, okay? That's, that's it, all right? So relatively no frills type kind of gym, okay? I say it's everything that you need and nothing that you don't, okay? So we got a couple racks in house. Uh, likewise, a little bit of turf where we can do some dynamic movements, okay? But the idea is to try to get people's body moving well in space while mitigating a lot of that associated pain that comes from, from sitting or, or previous injuries. Uh, this is one of the more earth shattering type kind of revelations that I've had, okay? I think we all have a fairly I decent idea of what a disease is, okay? But the actual phonetic breakdown of it, okay? Uh, this Latin prefix for uh, meaning the opposite of, to deprive of, or exclude or expel from, okay? Ease, the state of being comfortable, such as freedom from pain or discomfort, labor or difficulty, embarrassment or constraint, okay? So disease literally means the opposite of freedom from pain or discomfort, okay? The opposite of freedom from pain or labor or difficulty, okay? The opposite of freedom from embarrassment or constraint, all right? And a great quote by uh, scholar Socrates, no man has the right to be an amateur in a matter of physical training, okay? It's a shame for a man to grow old without seeing the beauty and strength of which his body is capable, okay? Socrates said that 2,500 years ago, okay? I think uh, everybody, you know, kind of has an idea of what health and wellness is, okay? But they either feel that they, you know, don't deserve or either just don't care to simply, you know, uh, experience what all their body, you know, truly has to offer. All right, so regular benefits of physical activity, right? Decreased blood pressure, heart rate, right? We're all fairly common or, or know, know the common, you know, the benefits of activity. But some of the non-gym benefits, right? Being able to hang out with your kids and grandkids, right? Being able to shoot hoops, ride bikes without having your low back, knees hurting, or being short of breath, okay? Uh, likewise, being able to increase hand-eye coordination and velocity, so that way you can add more distance to your golf drive or tennis swing or, you know, your home run swing in the softball league, all right? Uh, freedom from pain and physical time leisure activities such as fishing and hanging out with friends, okay? This lady right here on the bottom, 85 years old. Yeah, that's somebody's great grandma, guys. <laughs> All right, and then likewise, you know, you get to save money on, you know, medical costs, hospital bills, uh, higher insurance premiums, right, prescription medications. All right, so why Ocala Sports Performance, okay? Uh, as I mentioned before, right, relatively smaller setting, okay? So a lot of times people step into a big box gym and have that anxiety that everybody's looking at them, okay? So we kind of relieve that all eyes on me feeling, okay? I say uh, twice the value, half the price, right? So our focus is trying to keep our overhead as low as possible so that way we can provide a high quality training product that uh, is twice the value and half the price to some of those bigger box gyms. All right, no long-term gym commitments, okay? So we offer personal training in packages uh, that don't require you to sign a one or two year gym commitment, okay? Uh, regain mobility, stability, and strength uh, following an injury, so that way you can properly repair and rebuild, so that way you can get off the couch, off the sideline, right, and back to activity as quick as possible. 
okay? Uh, high energy, time efficient workout, so that way you don't have to spend all your free time working out in the gym, being able to train on your own schedule, okay? And then likewise, having a consistent source of motivation, accountability, and individualized programs that will push you beyond your comfort zone while staying within your physical limitations to help ensure that you reach your results. All right, uh, the fly is on the table, guys. This is our bread and butter, okay? So our focus is trying to get uh, more of a class setting in so that way we could bring that price point down a little bit further and open up the funnel for a lot more people to get involved in training. All right, so uh, we got a couple of different classes scheduled throughout the week. Uh, but like I say, more so just trying to get a lot more people involved in physical activity. All right, so uh, might jump ahead on you on this one, but uh, kind of talking about how you guys can help, okay? So, uh, our mission is to try to get 25 people in the program by the end of August, okay? So who do you know that's ready, willing, and able, right? Or suffers from that first step pain, all right? I think about, like, when we sit for a long time or we get out of bed in the morning, right, that first step, if it hurts, I need to talk to them, okay? Starting their whatever number diet, okay? And whatever different type, paleo, uh, Atkins, or whatnot, okay? Training newbies, recreational athletes, busy moms, and people who sit for a long time. All right, uh, check us out on Facebook, social media, Instagram, okay? A lot, of, a lot more active on Facebook, so uh, if you're gonna follow one, follow that one. Uh, yeah, and then, you know, just four key simple tricks to kind of help facilitate any training goal that you may have. Lose weight, get strong, right? Get your summer body right or whatever, okay? Try to lift moderately heavy weights, okay? Try to eat a relatively proportionate diet. Make sure you drink enough water and get enough sleep, okay? Training motto, see Dumbo here? I'm not that dumb, guys, I promise. But the motto is don't use machines, become one, okay? Yeah, uh, along with the website, callsportsperformance.com, and that's it.